A urinalysis is a physical and chemical evaluation of the urine that may include microscopic inspection. A urinalysis can have findings consistent with a urinary tract infection, also called a UTI, but the patient's history and physical examination must also be considered. A urinalysis is also rapidly and easily performed in a clinic or emergency department setting. Several tests performed in a urinalysis may help indicate infection, but must be interpreted within the broader context of the patient's presenting symptoms, history, and physical examination. The four most used and helpful tests include leukocyte esterase, nitrite, bacteria, white blood cells. Leukocyte esterase is produced when white blood cells are in the urine. Nitrite is a byproduct of certain types of bacteria in the urine. Both are measured by chemical dipstick tests, usually with visual interpretations as either positive or negative. If microscopy is performed along with the chemical tests in a urinalysis, then bacteria and white blood cells can be measured. Typically, greater than 10 white blood cells observed per high-powered field or any bacteria observed indicate a positive test. There are several important limitations to these tests. These tests indicate pyuria and bacteriuria, which may be suggestive of UTI in patients with typical symptoms, such as dysuria and urinary urgency or frequency. However, they are much less specific for UTI in other people. For example, people who use urinary catheters, people with bladder diseases or dysfunction, and elderly people frequently have pyuria and bacteria without UTI. In fact, for people with suspected catheter-associated UTI, leukocyte esterase and urine white blood cell count are specifically not recommended for diagnosis. Finally, treatment of a UTI should never be initiated based upon a urinalysis alone. Patient history, physical examination, and subsequent urine culture results must also be used to diagnose UTI and help determine optimal treatment.